Hi everyone, my name is Vice and welcome to Seven Mysteries. This is another RPG Maker horror game, and the only thing I really know about this is that apparently you have to really focus and investigate basically everything the game has to offer in order to get the actual good ending, which probably means I'm not going to get the good ending, but still, this seems like a really interesting game, so might as well go ahead and start a new game. Have you ever heard? There's a school in the north. There's a lot of schools in a lot of norths. That's cursed. Oh, that's bad. With strange and unexplainable phenomena. Because of this, all its students are filled with terror. And every day a new corpse is found in that school. Kind of like in another. The most recent victim is a freshman. Gee, that was ominous. Chapter 1, 13 Steps. This chapter is based on the story of Fudo High School. Is that an actual thing? I'll look it up after I'm done recording. At that time, ooh, it's dark. Oh, I'm down here. I thought it was the person up there at the top. Hmm. But yeah, definitely very spooky. Hmm. Okay, I'll talk to this person. My, what took you so long? Don't you know I've been waiting? Sorry, had to get this flashlight. You know, working every day as night patrol like this makes me dull sometimes. And the turtle is making excuses. Be quick this time. I don't want things to turn out like last time, okay? Your name's Mai? Like M-A-I, that's kind of normal, but M-Y? Eh, yeah, it's kind of weird. I'm going without you. The slow one will die, you know. Yeah, saying's also kind of weird. You mean hag. I can hear you. Next time I tell him gone for bad mouthing me. Huh. Okay, so I guess I'm just gonna. Huh, what happens if I go down here? Because again, you have to search everything that could include down here. Oh, whoop. What, what has happened? Okay, so X is a pause button, I guess. And so it's escape, okay. But no, it doesn't appear to be anything down there. And I can run, but not that fast. This leads you to leave the problem be. What was that? No, it's a problem. It leads me to believe the problem be any chase scenes here. Okay. Can I inspect you? No. What are you? There's something in here. Ah, go away, Norton Live Update. Eh. Sorry, uh, I'm glad you couldn't see that, but unfortunately I could. <laughs> what is in there? Look at it! Nothing there. Ooh, so this is where I save. <laughs> yes, I'll go ahead and, you know, mod as well. In case I end up dying soon. What kind of map is that? Looks like Westeros in the Nine Cities almost. So when yeah, that's a window. Is there anything to see? No. Can we go in this door? Class 10A, the door is locked. What's glass? You can break it down. Okay, no doors down here. What the Not long after he started moving, the lights began to flash. He half believed it, half not. He didn't know whether the lights had really flashed, he was just paranoid because of the dark and gloomy atmosphere of the school. Okay, so this is the story of this guy's death. Like, I'm not investigating now, I'm dying. With the crap. Eh. Okay. So that freshman who do night watch... There was a lot... They have freshmen who do night watches? That doesn't seem okay, and I guess... Okay, I guess that sound is just... When you move, kind of like in Pokemon, that weird shuffling noise. Okay. That's a very suspicious broom. Oh. That moment. Flash, I ran out of battery. Crap. But I still see the light from the battery. Oh, never mind. Right after that, you heard the sound of breaking glass. A thought crossed his mind. This must be a prank from the girl. Or maybe a new one. So he decided to go to class 10C and get the prankster. Uh, don't think it's a prankster. 
Yeah, maybe this is gonna be like Stanley Parable sort of thing if I just keep going. If I just keep going, I can avoid all of this. No, apparently not. Crap. Okay, but... Yeah, dang, it is really dark. Need a key to open it. Well, where can I find a key? Oh, in that plant. He said he saw something there. Maybe that something was the key. Oh, dang, it is pitch. Pitch black. Class 10C key. Okay. Just as I thought. Because I fortunately am a very smart gamer. Now to go in here. Where it's even darker. Like, I can't even... Okay, there I am. I was like, where the crap am I? Okay. Oh. Where? Okay, there. Okay, there I am. I was looking too low. Found a battery. So... Whew, some batteries here. Now I'm saved. Or maybe not. Wait a second. The door is locked. Then it's not my who pulled the joke. Yeah, though he knew what it was, he couldn't overcome his fear. He was confused, worried, and didn't know what to do. A moment later, he remembered what led him there. The sound of shattering glass. He crept closer. And closer. And closer. I guess I'm gonna have to creep close. Even though I really don't want to. Okay, um... Oh, it's the window. A rock. Wait. Someone behind the window. I don't see anyone. I have to find my right now. I don't know if it was because he's terrified. Or because of something else. But he ran like hell. Like something very serious was gonna happen. Eh, 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 eh. Run away, run away, run, 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 I really like this game so far. I mean, there hasn't been really much to judge the game by as of yet. Whoa, 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 whoa. And a scream rang out. It was also a really horrible noise. The scream made him freeze in fear. But for some reason, he kept stepping into the darkness. Even though he knew fear had overcome his soul. But it was like, dang, this is some. Whoa, 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 whoa. Holy crap, there's some gripping stuff here. Damn, my shocked me. It's time for the school to get repaired. Okay. Uh. Can I go in here? Door is locked. Door is locked. Door is locked. And what do you know, door is locked? Oh. It's kind of strange there's some glowing papers here. There's a paper. Looks like an alphabet. Why is it here? Absidy. Where's the rest of it? I thought this was going to be about me finding the rest of the alphabet. Stairway. Remember when I first came to the school, he and I played counting the steps. I don't like how the turn that this music is taking is kind of, kind of very ominous. But now he is not here anymore. <clears throat> Who is he? One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. This is going to be 13 on 13, 11, 12, dot dot dot, 13. And the strange and unexplainable started happening, but that was not the most horrible thing. When? When did they build this step? It can't be. He ignored it and kept looking for his friend, but the worst awaits him. Right after he hit the 13th step. 
What? No, I'm go I'm going back up. No. Screw this. No. I'm gonna live. I'm gonna live. Ah, except this has all already happened. This is a ghost story. This has happened. I'm gonna die. The lights are back on. What a relief. Thanks just some problems in the generator room. Mai must have gone home. I should get home too before it hits midnight. Oh! So that just happened. Ugh! Mai! What is that noise? Uh... How was he then? No one knows for sure what happens next. But think he ended up dead too. Weird. Your story seems to fit with mine. It's about that school's music room. I'm not sure about the beginning of the story because each person tells a different beginning. It's the death of this girl. Everybody shivers when they talk about it. At that time, she was walking alone in the school's hallway. Chapter 2, The Music Room. What a turtle. Not sure what that's supposed to mean. But, okay. He's gonna... Yeah, just be safe. He's gonna save right there, but okay, I think... I see how the format of this is, it's just short little snippets, like seven different stories that all come together somehow, and while I'm in those stories I need to do a deep investigation, so this game is probably going to be shorter than I would prefer, but still pretty awesome, so I think I'm going to go ahead and leave this episode here, you know, got through one chapter, starting on a second chapter, when I'm to the music. Okay, it's just on a loop. Okay, that was kind of creepy. But anyways, thank you all so much for watching. If you like what you see, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. It really helps me out a lot. If you have suggestions for other games for me to play, let me know down in the comments. Again, thank you for watching, and I will see you on the next Vice's Virtues. Catch you guys later.